So is the famous scuba sweatshirt worth $118? Are the Align leggings worth the hefty price of $98? In this video, I will be comparing Lulu items versus Amazon items. And I went ahead and went on Amazon and purchased exact duplicates to see if the Lulu items are worth the hefty price, if we can find something that looks similar or is the same for a much lower price. So I have five different items I will be comparing and seeing if there's a better duplicate for less. If you are interested in anything, it's all linked down below and let's go ahead and hop right in. And you guys, for this video, I was on a mission. I wanted to find literally exact duplicates, so I was even looking down at the materials from Amazon products, comparing it to the Lulu products, and trying to find as close as I can to the Lulu items as far as what the materials are made out of. So let's go ahead and start with the famous scuba sweatshirts. Make sure you see every influencer, content creator, own one, wear it, rock it. So I have this gray one, which is the Lululemon version. And then this white one is the Amazon duplicate version. The Lululemon one is $118. It's 100% cotton. And the Amazon version is $42 and it is 50% cotton and 50% polyester. So looking at all the ribbing detail, the stitching, it is shockingly so similar if you put these two side by side you really have a hard time telling which one is the lulu version and which one is the amazon version like the similar version from amazon they really nailed it on the stitching i mean they got it right in the back they got all the ribbing right in the front they even did the exact same zipper where it has the shoelace tied to it and it is like darn similar i was honestly surprised the only thing i noticed the difference between the lulu version and the amazon version is if you look at the bottom of the sweatshirt the amazon version it tapers in to your hips versus the lulu version it kind of has that boxier fit so it tapers out a little bit so putting it side by side here you can see the difference and by the way the lulu version i'm wearing it in the smallest size extra small slash small the amazon version i accidentally ordered it in a medium regardless of the sizing um it does look different at the hemline uh the amazon version is longer in length the lululemon one is more cropped that is truly the only difference i notice as far as looks with the two sweatshirts now if we're talking about the material i feel like the lulu version feels more like a solid sweatshirt like your classic 100 percent cotton sweatshirt that's very durable and to me the way the Lululemon scuba sweatshirt falls, I think it looks more pretty. I think the way it lays on and drapes on my body, I just think it looks more flattering. I also like that it's a little bit shorter in length. It works well for me being five foot one. And I have to say the Amazon version, it is 50% polyester and 50% cotton. You can feel that. Like it doesn't feel like the Lulu version. I've had the Lululemon sweatshirt for a year and a half. Now this thing has been beat up, you guys. Like I constantly put in the washer. I always put it in the dryer, which I know you're probably not supposed to do that. It holds up so well. Stains get off of it so easily. So if I were to pick between the Amazon and the Lulu version of the scuba sweatshirt, I personally prefer the Lululemon scuba sweatshirt. Now, if you're into the sweatshirt, but you don't want to spend a lot of money on one, Amazon version, honestly, I think is totally fine to purchase and save some money on. I mean, it's less than half of the price of the Lulu version. So that is incredible. And you have almost the exact same look. Now let's get into Align Dupe Leggings. Now I think this is the one you guys are going to be so surprised about with my opinion. The Lululemon Align Legging, their most famous product probably on their site. It retails for 98 freaking dollars. The material is made up of 81% nylon and 19% lycra. I think I'm pronouncing that correctly, lycra, lycra. No, it's not liquor. That sounds weird. And then the Amazon version is 81% polyamide and 19% lycra, and it retails for $32. So right off the bat, they feel so similar. This is the one I was truly the most shocked about. I can't even tell you guys how many freaking leggings I've tried in my life. And this is literally like Amazon whoever sells this nailed it in being a dupe for the Lululemon Align Legging. Now, I have to say, the Align Legging, quality-wise, 
I'm sorry, it sucks. I hate saying that. I just want to be just straight up and honest with you guys. I've had the legging for a little over a year and I haven't even worn it enough for it to look this worn in. And camera, you can't tell, but on the left leg around my thigh, I'll try to put a close up. I, okay, this was my fault, obviously, but I spilled raw batter on my leg while I was making waffles for my family and I could not get it off. The texture is there no matter how much I cleaned it, I could not get it off the legging which was so sad and it pills so easily it also the fabric looks so worn in after like a few wears which really sucks and i even gave the line legging two chances i purchased another align legging and it's starting to do the same thing the fabric is looking worn out the stitching is coming apart which is so sad that's the amazon version the difference I notice in like the fabric, it feels a little bit thicker and it feels like it has a little bit more compression. Not too much. I think this is still great as like a loungy legging. Personally, I actually prefer that. It's stretchy and very soft, very buttery. And the material, if you look at it, is almost exactly the same. But to me, I say forget about the $98 stretchy pants and just go for the Amazon dupe version. Next up, let's compare a pair of Lululemon shorts to an Amazon dupe version. So this one is called the Inner Glow Short. The one from Lululemon, it retails for $68. And it is made up of 92% cotton and 8% elastane. And the Amazon version here is $21 and it is 82% cotton and 18% polyester. So right off the bat, I'm just gonna put a side by side here. The Amazon version is huge for me. Um, I can tie it around the waistline, but I have to tie it so much that it looks a little silly. Still very comfortable and very nice. It's not as stretchy as the Lululemon version as well because the Lulu version has 8% elastane, so it has a really nice stretchiness to it, but still holds its shape. I went with the smallest size I could get my hands on in these shorts, which is a size small, and it's just a little too big around the waistline. Uh, the length is good. It fits well around the butt and thighs. It's just the waist is a little too big. I think if I went down to an extra small, if they had it in stock for me, it would have fit a little bit better, but I can't imagine it fitting more similar to the Lulu version. The Lululemon version of the Inner Glow short, again, very stretchy. The fabric is thicker. The stitching, in my opinion, is better. But if you look at the look of it, it does look very similar. In my opinion, I prefer the Lulu version, even though it is so expensive. It holds up so well. Now let's move on to the Align long sleeve. So I'm wearing the dupe version from Amazon. So the difference between the two is the Lulu version is 81% nylon, 19 lycra, which I think is the same as their a line legging yes it is it retails for 34 dollars it's on final sale by the way but it's originally 78 dollars and then the amazon version is 81 polyamide and 19 lycra which is the same as the align legging dupe that i shared the amazon version actually retails for 32 dollars for this top so the only difference is two dollars because the align long sleeve is on final sale so the difference between the two you can tell the fit is a little bit different on the align long sleeve it's scooped in the front and scooped in the back so it looks very feminine which i really like then the amazon version is just scooped in the front and it's a little bit more cropped however the feeling of it is literally exactly the same but again the amazon version is a little bit thicker for me personally i think the amazon version is better in my opinion because i love how the scoop neckline isn't as low as the lulu version so that's why i really appreciate the amazon version because the neckline goes up a little bit more can't see any cleavage the price difference is two dollars so it's really honestly up to you what you prefer personally for me i think i'll stock up on more colors of the amazon version and then last but not least i will be comparing the lululemon straight jogger pant to a similar version i found from amazon the lulu version it retails for 118 dollars but it is on final sale for 69 dollars limited in sizing but just wanted to point that out they do have it on final sale and then the amazon version it retails for 35 dollars and it comes in so many more colors than the lulu version so the amazon version in material it's 69 percent polyamide and 31% spandex. They feel so, so similar. Like the material, it's shocking how similar they feel. But if you look at the waistband, you do notice a difference between the two. Um, the Lululemon one kind of has that more scrunchy look to it. 
the Amazon version doesn't look as scrunchy. They have like the same look, but there's just like a little bit of differences between the stitching and where the lines are and stuff. The material is seriously the same, very smooth, very stretchy. I have to say, this is where I'm really torn. I really love both of them. I think the Amazon version is a little bit more in that looser fit, naturally. I'm wearing an extra small. And then the Lulu version, I'm wearing it in a size zero. But I do have to say, I should have went with a size two because it does run small in the waistline. So it is a little too tight for me in the waistline, which can be uncomfortable, especially towards the end of the day but it does fit well in the legs and the amazon version has more of that straight fit a little bit more tapered out versus the lululemon version is a little bit slimmer but i think if i went up a size i would have more of that straight look similar to the amazon version now again this is where i'm torn i can't pick a favorite between the two because both of them the quality is fantastic no, I'm torn. You guys can pick which one you like the best. The Lulu version sadly is getting low on stock. It's final sale. I'm not sure if they're going to carry it anymore. Maybe they will restock it when it gets into the fall winter months when people will be more interested in buying these pants. But I love the Amazon version. I really like how it's not too tight at the waist and just the way it sits right on my hips and just lays looks so flattering. I just love the fit of it. All right, you guys, so that is it for this video. That was Lululemon versus Amazon. I hope this video was really enjoyable to watch. Hear my honest opinion. Let me know if you would like me to do another video like this because I am a Lululemon fan, but I do want to find similar looks for less and i hope this was enjoyable and helpful and thank you guys so much for watching i will see you in my next video bye